One of the amazing features of Electric Daisy Carnival is their colorful and beautiful selection of rides strewn across the festival grounds which you could partake in between sets. EDC really brings quality to the table, and at EDC Las Vegas, there were about 10 festival rides, which I'll be pointing out with red arrows on the left. And on the final day, Sunday, my friend Jensen and I spent about four hours running around the festival grounds, documenting what we saw. And in this video, we'll be showing off and talking about the rides a little bit. Before jumping into some footage on the rides, I wanted to give a little bit of information about myself and Jensen. I'm Carson, aka Bassmaster Rush. I appear in the bottom left frame on the left side for a little bit. Honestly, don't have much footage of myself from that day because I spent so much time behind the camera. And I make EDM concert videos like vlogs, sets, etc. So if you enjoy the video, please consider smashing that subscribe button to help support the channel. And I have a ton of other EDC videos linked in my description and on my channel. So feel free to check them out. In the top left frame, we have Jensen who was my partner in crime in shooting footage on Sunday. We met him by chance leaving the hotel and he very kindly offered to give us a ride to the festival that day and the rest is history. The first ride that we will be taking a look at is the Insomniac Helm. And while everyone gets strapped in here, I'll talk a little bit about the format of this video. As mentioned, EDC has a ton of rides, so we only really got around to see a couple and we didn't have enough time to actually ride them. Perhaps next year at EDC 2022, I will make an effort to ride one of them, but the lines are pretty long and we had other things to do. So the rides that we did check out, I'll just be showing off some footage of them in action, some of the shots that Jensen and I got, and from here on out, there'll probably not be too much commentary. After seeing the Insomniac Helm in full swing, we headed over to check out the Crazy Dumbo. Around the flower tower, there is a ride called the lollipop swings, which hoist you quite high in the air.
back by Neon Garden, there's actually a bobsled. We had a bit of trouble getting footage of the bobsled in action. Nearby Quantum Valley, there is the cliffhanger, which looks pretty epic. Of course, there is the iconic giant wheel, Ferris wheel, smack dab in the middle of the festival. It looks amazing. If you ride it, I'm pretty sure at the top, you can get a pretty good picture of the festival grounds. Right by Corona Beach, there was the Super Shot, which was this very epic ride that takes you to the top and catapults you down. We waited about 20 minutes to get this shot since it took so long to load up and it went so quickly, but Jensen got the shot. The final ride that we have a little bit of footage of is the Himalaya, which swings you back and forth. So those are the rides that we checked out. I hope you enjoyed the video. You know, please consider subscribing and be on the lookout for more EDC vlogs, walkthroughs, and content. You can check out my channel for the Friday vlog, which is already posted. And soon I will be doing a massive overview video, so be on the lookout for that. Much love and have a great day. Thank you! Yeah, for sure, that was man. amazing! Hey, thank you.